There's a reason why these giant, squishy monsters are the number one chosen breed for search and rescue work. This is Vino, and she's a 19-month-old bloodhound. Are we going to be a good dog? Despite how these dogs may have been represented in the movies, the Bloodhound is anything but a lazy porch dog. They can weigh anywhere between 80 to 110 pounds, making them one giant bull in a china shop. They were designed to track and hunt, using their incredible sense of smell, and to this day, they are still employed as man trailers. The tips of his ear, her ears are all dirty and gross. Their long ears scoop up invisible scent particles when they're tracking and sweep them toward the nose. This allows the dogs to carry reference samples while they hunt. The bloodhound requires a fenced-in yard and should always be walked on a leash. They are very high-energy dogs, and when they catch an important scent, their instincts completely take over. This can mean putting their nose to the ground and ignoring everything else around them. The Bloodhound is not a breed of dog for novice pet owners as they can be difficult to train and they tend to be especially destructive during puppyhood. Trying to put a happy hoodie over these massive ears was a task all on its own. On the plus side of this breed, they are very affectionate with family, they do well with kids, they are very dog friendly, and also friendly towards strangers. But on the downside, they do shed quite a bit, and they are excessive droolers. Talking about shedding, I removed an entire other bloodhound of fur today. These guys are very tall dogs, standing as tall as 27 inches on the shoulder, and they have a life expectancy of 11 to 15 years. Okay. Good girl, Vino. Good girl. Good girl, Vino. It's okay. It's okay. Good boy. It's a girl. Come on, feel nice. In order to clean this girl's very big ears, I soak a makeup pad and I put it inside the ear. Then I rub the ear, I remove the makeup pad, and then I take a fresh dry makeup pad to wipe the ears out clean. I sprayed her down in bubblegum pet cologne and the vivacious Vino is all finished. She left me quite the mountain of fur. Today, for our pet of the day, we have Ellie the Irish Setter. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this beautiful scent hound. Hey, come here, you're drooling everywhere now. Good girl. Oh. Go over there. Come here. Go see, go see. Oh. Good girl. Good oh. girl. I want you to howl. So I want you to howl. So no, no, no. Oh. No.